Did you know that most vehicles 2008 or newer are legally required to have a tire pressure monitoring system or TPMS? Well, this system makes it easier for drivers to be aware of low tire pressure that may be unsafe. Well, how does it work, you might say? Well, TPMS uses a wheel-mounted sensor that communicates the current tire pressure in each tire via radio waves to the vehicle's onboard computer. Now, this is important because low tire pressure may result in poor vehicle handling, reduced brake efficiency, poor fuel mileage, even possible tire failure. Now, there are two methods used to warn drivers of low tire pressure. And the first one uses a solid amber light to indicate tire pressure has dropped 25% below what the manufacturer recommends, but it does not specify the tire location. Now, if this light begins flashing, the TPMS is malfunctioning and immediate attention is required to repair the system. The second method features a diagram of a vehicle and shows pressure by each tire location. In a low pressure situation, the diagram indicates which tire is underinflated. Now, do I need to maintain my TPMS system? <laughs> oh yes. Tire pressure sensors are powered by tiny little batteries and when they fail, the sensor itself must be replaced. TPMS sensor valves also wear out and they may become corroded over time. And servicing TPMS valves during tire replacement or repair helps to ensure their proper operation and it'll extend their life. Proper tire inflation not only saves you money through better fuel mileage and longer tire life, it's also vital for safe driving. So by all means, if you see your TPMS light come on or flash, take your vehicle into your service professional right away.